let's type here one two three four five let's see how many other ways exist to be able to do the same thing please don't worry about yellow numbers which are changing here i will explain it to you later it doesn't have any relationship with our immediate discussion another way of typing one two three four five is to say equal to this one plus one and then copy it down still one other way is to type one and two then mark both of them right click and then fill series that is one two three four five one other way is to right click on this come a little bit lower go up release it and series i want to go in step of one from here to five and i want to go in columns okay right one other way is to type here equal to rows from this point column from k5 to k5 but i go and make the first k5 absolute referencing f4 that is absolute referencing one then if i copy it down the other numbers will appear there. same is true for columns i can type one two three four five or i can go here and i say one plus one and then left click copy to the right or i can go here again right click come a little bit down go back release it series we want you to go in a step of one two five but this time we want you to go in rows not in columns okay therefore we have one two three four five or finally i can go here and type column columns and i go to the same place column close it and make this first one absolute now it says from l4 to l4 but if i copy to the right the first l4 remains l4 but the second one becomes m4 and if i copy to the right L4 remains L4 for the first component, but second component becomes N4 and so on. Now we talk about index function and we use rows and columns functions inside index function. Suppose I have a long column of data and I want to put it into a nice table. So one way of doing it is to say equal to one five five zero so that is the first number but as i enter it the number is changed over there because here these numbers are random i will later explain what do we do with random numbers another way of doing it is to go here equal to this one and then copy it down that is fine equal to this one and then copy it down then i should go over there but this would be a tedious job i will show you a better way to do it i will go here i type rows i go to the cell itself here column so c2 to c2 i just make the first one absolute enter copy it down copy it to the right so i have numbers from one to ten then i go here and i say plus columns again i go over there 
from that cell column to itself make the first one absolute enter and then copy it down and then copy to the right I have some numbers but those are not what I want I want 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 and so on so I'll go here and multiply the column by 10 enter copy it down copy to the right that is what I want but instead of starting from 10 from 1 and going to 50 it starts from 11 and goes to 60 so all I need is to put a parenthesis here and say minus 1 and then copy it down and then copy to the right now I have 1 to 50 here then I'll go over there and I type index and then index says Give me the array. I'll go here. Control shift down F4 to lock it. So that is my range. That is the column I have. And the row number, we want to put the first number in the first one, second in the second one, third in the third one, as I have here, and 11, 31, 41 over there, and the last number here. So I have the range that I want to look at it and I have made it absolute therefore when I copy it here it is still A2 to A51 but over there this C2 remains the same this C2 will become G11 and so on the first number is there and then I have all the numbers 1150 is the last number 1150 is the last number so that was index function but now let's see what match function is match function says find for me match lookup value for example suppose we are looking for 1400 1400 lookup array the same place shift control down enter now I'm looking for exact match so I enter 0 here the first number is 1400 now if I change it to say 1800 and I'm not sure if 1800 is there no 1800 we don't have it over there let me copy this copy and paste the special it by values now suppose I am looking for 800 100 and exact says the first 800 was observed in row 5 so that was our discussion on rows columns index and match function